Hello, today it is uh, December 23rd of 2017. Uh, Darlene, my ex-wife, just put a turkey in the oven. Um, thought I'd update you a little bit on what's been going on around here. Um, my daughter, Hillary, bought Darlene and myself both new mattresses. I've actually got video of Hillary putting the, I may show that to you. And <laughs> as soon as we got the mattresses, uh, we were notified that, uh, of course the mattresses were made in China that uh, they are not fireproof. They didn't pass the... So the company notified us, I believe. I don't think it was Amazon. But, well, Amazon notified us, but I think the company said that they were going to send uh, a pad for the mattresses that's flame retardant or whatever. So I'm not sure what's going on. Um, Now, also, I made a video. I think you may have seen a little clip of that. Uh, my, I got my son a uh, air inflatable mattress, and he's using that. And I think you may have seen a little clip of that. I'm not sure, but I have that. Maybe I'll. I don't know. Those videos really aren't edited. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them here. Uh, but my son is, uh, he's liking the air mattress at, um, uh, working out okay. Um, let's see, I should have made some notes. Uh, Social Security people are getting a 2% increase in uh, their Social Security starting next month. Uh, so I think I came out at a $50 increase or a $60 increase, I believe. I didn't actually do the, do the math. And every year at this time of the year, and I think the last couple of years we haven't got any increase, but this year we're getting an increase. And every year the uh, apartment complex that I live in they increase the uh, rent lease, that, you know. So just, <laughs> and it worked out, it worked out a couple of times that way. The day that I officially get the thing from the Social Security telling how much I'll be getting is usually the day that the apartment complex people <laughs> inform me about the new uh, increase in rent. So uh, the apartment rent here is going up $50 a month. I've been paying $750 a month uh, for the last year. And now I'll be paying, starting in February, I believe it is, I'll be paying $800 a month. And then with the extra, a, a few years ago, there were no extras. Uh, well, of course, electricity, we, you know, we pay for the electricity. But the apartment people didn't charge for the water and trash. And so a couple of years ago, they started, there was a, that year, there was a big increase because there was a big increase in the rent. And there was a big increase in the, that they started charging for these other things. So, uh. With the other, not counting the electricity, of course. Um, actually, the rent will be because of the pet, the cat fee, uh, trash, uh, water. I'll be paying for rent. Uh, that eight hundred will be eight hundred and sixty-one dollars. I'll be paying a month. Uh, I wish I'd have made some notes. Uh, 
I, I, I didn't because I kind of thought that I needed to uh, get a video out. Hadn't put one out in a while. That's the reason. I remember my new camera, the G7, Panasonic G7. I really haven't taken uh, very much uh, video with it or even images. What I did do is I did get it paired. Let's see, did I do that Wi-Fi or did I do that? I think I paired it Wi-Fi with my app on the cell phone. And it's pretty neat. I just played with it for, I got it paired with it and I just played with it for a few minutes but I will be able to uh, from the cell phone control my camera so if I set the camera up here I'll be able to zoom in change settings and do all that kind of stuff so I've just I did it a week or so ago but I haven't got around to doing very much you're probably wondering why I've got this uh, oh another thing uh, that sort of leads into this computer here on the screen. Uh, remember, I had a Chrome book. I gave that to my son in Florida, and I think he uses that at his business. He needed a computer. And uh, so that left me with, and I ended up, well, I ended up buying, I think, after that, or I already had a Chrome. Yeah, I had a, a Chrome box. Uh, Darlene, I think she got some type of a virus on her computer. She uh, just doesn't. <clears throat> she just doesn't seem to believe that that's extremely dangerous. You know, clicking on links or going to sites unless you have to or whatever. And uh, I think she got something uh, on her her Windows uh, 10 computer and and usually and she gets some she would have a problem regular and uh, my son uh, would format her computer for her and this this last time uh, he just couldn't format the computer get Windows 10 I think it's the uh, well then I tried putting Windows 10 and then I tried putting Linux on I think it's the hard drive has been destroyed in some manner um, so I gave her, her to use the Chrome box and this time she's okay using it but she's not ha she would like to have Windows 10 back uh, so she can play some games and when and when we say games you know we uh, you're thinking fancy she just goes to the solitaire and, and places and, uh, online where you <clears throat> which are dangerous I mean the sites that are dangerous are what porn sites or trying to go find get you know uh, hacked software those sites are dangerous and the other one is sites like that that she goes to that are uh, they want you to pay a, a few dollars for a game a simple game we're not talking about I can't think of any computer game. The only one I ever play is Civilization V. But uh, she's just asking for problems when she get, <clears throat> goes someplace and and uh, downloads repeatedly uh, and, or plays online, really, uh, those things. So, um, ouch. So, so she's using my Chrome box. There's the printer. I got a printer recently, you remember, that we can now print to it. And also the Chrome. You know, printing from a Chrome is problematic. Uh, it can be done, but it's not easy. And so we, had, we got this inexpensive uh, printer and we can all print just from our computers to it or even from my cell phone we can print to the printer so that, that took care of that problem the uh, well other problem for her is she can't get to her windows type online games 
that you play that she plays. I thought about just I don't know how much they cost really. I haven't kept I don't I've never had a well, when the kids were little, you know, we bought the Atari and and different things like that for them. But I don't know I thought about well just maybe if if uh, buy her an Xbox or buy her something, let her play games on that. Although she would never want to pay for anything. And of course, I'm sure they come with a game or two, and I'd be willing to buy it. But she'd want to keep doing something new because she would. But anyway, I thought about that. Then I. Uh... Anyway, thinking about different things, trying to solve the little problems that she uh, has. The uh, camera program with Chrome just doesn't work right for what she's trying to do. And uh, <clears throat> so I was trying to think of different things. And uh, then it came to me. I have, this is really a nice this Dell computer, as you know, it, it, it's okay for what I'm doing. I'm not into gaming at all. But then it hit me. Oh, this would be, I could give her my old computer, which she, she knows it is a good computer, and she would love to have it. I could give her my old Dell computer here, and I could then justify buying for me a new computer. So uh, I looked around. I've just started looking, and you know me. I'll, I've looked on, uh, just started looking, Cyber Power PC uh, computers. And I'm thinking about this one. But you know, since I don't do gaming, really, don't really, I could give up... Uh, Civilization Five. I could give up game playing. Um, so this may be overkill, but what I'm looking at, of course, is 4K video. Having the power to deal with 4K video, having the power to render them and uh, edit them and do those things. So this may be overkill. So this is December 23rd. I'm not sure if tomorrow or Christmas Day Hillary's coming over. Russell's supposed to come over, my grandson. Russell's big into computer gaming. Uh, he's 27, I believe. Big into computer gaming. Uh, knows a lot about computers. And my son also uh, knows a lot about computers. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to see what he says. Try to get him to... Well, since he's not here and he won't have, or since he will be here and not have his computer, <laughs> uh, he won't be able to be gaming. So maybe I can get him to uh, give me a recommendation on. Uh, don't know if you can hear my stomach growling or not. It's 8:30 a.m. I haven't taken my morning medication. I haven't put anything into my stomach other than some Coke, Coca-Cola. Got to be kind of careful when you say Coke to make sure they realize we're talking about not talking about a drug. We're talking about Coca-Cola. Well, we are talking about a drug, aren't we? So um, I've been looking at the videos on YouTube about the cyber power PCs. Um, company's new to me. Uh, and apparently you can just basically go to their site here, of course, it's being sold on. Uh, but you can go and pick the various parts that you want, and they'll put them together for you. When they send them to you, they pack it really well, the uh, computer, when they ship it to you. And you get a box with the various parts and things that, um, I mean, it's put together. But then you get an, also a box that will they'll throw in the, they'll throw in the DVDs. <laughs> But then a lot of these units don't even come with the you know DVD uh, drives. But I saw one guy and he he got his and there was the 
extra slides if you want to put in uh, hard drives and such. So anyway, I'm going to get my, but I'd welcome your advice also. Uh, gaming is not that important, so maybe I could spend, instead of $1,500, maybe I could spend uh, 1000 but I still want to get some power because who knows what's going to happen. Although I will be 78. Maybe I shouldn't be worrying about the future. I'll be 78 in March. I believe. I think I have a more powerful uh, NVIDIA in the closet than the GTX 1070. Or else I have, maybe I have, but a uh, more powerful than what I have in this computer. I forget. I should have made notes. Um, so I will f be filling in on what's uh, what's going on, and I think I forgot some important uh, important things this is uh, haven't had a chance to really read the manual you know I watched all those videos as I told you about the G7 uh, <laughs> and watched all of those YouTube videos and then as soon as I got this and as soon as I went out with it my mind went totally blank uh, with uh, how to do anything. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. And I'm going to upload this. And maybe before long I'll be recording my videos on a new computer. And uh, we'll see. But if, if you have any advice... I'll put the link to this underneath and then take a look at it. And you might take a look at some of the cyber power PCs and uh, see what you think. I think the only problem is if you're a gamer, you're probably going to say, okay, this is a terrific one, you know, uh, computer, but you need to have, a, oh, I think that's, that's what I was going to say. Anyway, people, you can contact them and, or go to their site or whatever and, uh, pick the various things you want. Uh, I think for me and for other people, you'd be much better if you go and say, okay, because they like they charge $15 to uh, uh, speed up the what do you call it? Speed up the uh, I've never done that CPU or whatever. Overrated, overclock it, yeah, over, cl overclocking them. You're just asking for, you know, you're just asking for trouble. If they make a ton of these and have them set up, you know, all the, they put the parts in, they ship them out. If there's a problem with them, people let them know, and then they realize, oh, we made a mistake. But if you go to their site or whatever and say, okay, well, I want to pay $15, overclock this and do this and do that, I think you're going to run into trouble, so... I'm looking to, um, you know, buy a product that's being shipped and that they have an assembly line for them. I uh, don't want to tell them to uh, pull out this other part and put in the other part. Uh, but this computer, 600 watts of... Uh, I think the power supply is 600 watts. That's nice. I've got a computer here. I have a, I forget, I have a much better video card. But my power supply on this computer does not support it. You know, it needs more power. And then, of course, also the cables in there don't. Of course, you can buy the cables for them. I'd just much rather. And two, liquid cool closed a liquid cool circuit. Don't really think that's needed, but 
I was watching some YouTube videos, and I think I think the guy said it was twenty-seven dollars or something like that. That's you know extra. That that's worth it. To, so anyway, let me know what you think, and uh, I hope to make a video before maybe do live streaming. I don't know, but I guess I better. It's uh, want to wish you all a happy holidays, a Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah. Uh, whatever. So, uh, oh, by the way, my son's on his new medication. He is so much better. So I think the family's going to have a, uh, I think we're going to have a happy Christmas, and we may have a much better uh, New Year. And I think in the next day or two, I'm not sure, Hillary is coming. Oh, that's right. Hillary got, remember I, Hillary got Darlene a new mattress, got me a new mattress. Uh, she also got me this new chair, which uh, actually hurts my back a little bit, but it's because it's the other chair. I it, This chair is trying to make me sit better and has some lumbar support or whatever, so it's trying to make me sit better. And, but it's a little, can take a little breaking in of my body. So anyway, I have a new chair for Christmas, a new mattress for Christmas, and uh, what else? Darlene's making turkey. Hillary has a turkey. Uh, we have some steaks. I'm not sure when they're going to be made. So we should have a, a very nice Christmas. Hope you all have a nice Christmas. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. I'd like to get to 10,000 subscribers. YouTube, as I mentioned, I think, in the other video, has some new functions. And right now they're just rolling them out to people that have 10,000 or more subscribers. They're functions that I would really like to use. Uh, also, should I mention or not... Uh, if you follow Boogie, what is it, 2928 or whatever it is, uh, you might check in with him, send him a little bit of love or whatever. Uh, he announced on his site that uh, uh, his wife and him have decided mutually they've, they're ending their marriage of seven years, seven years or whatever. So I'll put a link below to, uh, if you're not, I've been following him since the since the beginning, uh, since he came on YouTube. So, uh, thank you very much for watching.